Why did the letter F get in trouble? Because it's always in the middle of shift. And by shift I mean a certain notorious four-letter word. Now onto our topic, the fascinating history of curse words. You see, our colourful lexicon of expletives didn't just appear out of thin air. It has roots going back to biblical times when the earliest swears were often religious in nature. Fast forward to the roaring 20s and we find the phrase four-letter word emerging. A coy euphemism to denote those naughty words we all know and love or hate, depending on the situation. And speaking of four-letter words, ever wondered about the origins of damn or the infamous F-word? Well, they trace back to terms describing similar acts in the past. Isn't it wild to think that when you stub your toe and let out a choice word, you're actually participating in a linguistic tradition that spans centuries? So next time you drop your toast butter side down and a certain word slips out, remember, you're not just swearing, you're partaking in a centuries-old linguistic tradition. And before we wrap up this linguistic journey, remember, the full video on our channel is a trove of taboo treasures. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up if you learned something new today, and check out the full video for more juicy details about the history of your favourite or not-so-favourite curse words. Until next time, keep your language colourful.